So, um, scenario number one, first of all, I'm salaries. Normally, have you heard salaries from a basic salaries and allowances? Normally, when you join with, co with this company, right, you can get as, a, as an employee, you can get allowances, right? Allowances means simply what? Allowances simply means our benefits like full allowances, right? Food allowances, uniforms, right? Then police officers, they can get uniform allowances from the government, right? In addition to the basic salary, right? Allowances. There are so many allowances, benefits. Therefore, right? Therefore, there are there are basic salaries. We call that one. And what's the meaning of basic salary? Right? Now, am I then? If your parents are uh, working uh, in government, you can get the, you can uh, refer appointment letter, right? When joining with the companies as an employee, they will give you appointment letter, right? Appointment letter, there is a conditions. What are the working hours, right? Salaries, what are the allowances? All the conditions are mentioned in that appointment letter. They, therefore, basic salary means that fixed amount, right? Fixed amount mentioned in the appointment letter. Right, appointment letter. They are for basic salary. Basic salary won't be changed actually, right? That's the fixed sum. And also allowances. Right? Allowances. Let's assume allowances. Right. I told you benefits. Right. There are so many allowances. Food allowances, uh, uh, uniform allowances, poor allowance, right? <coughs> Traveling allowance. They are for basic salary and all allowances. Right. Total will be we call them a gross salary. Gross salary. Gross salary. Right? Gross salary. Therefore, am I? Right? Let's assume our basic salary. Uh, basic salary, let's assume 50,000. Right? Basic salary won't be changed. We said 50,000. Allowances, let's assume uh, 10,000. 10,000. They are full of my gross salary should be how much? 60,000. Right? Gross salary should be 60,000. Understood? 60,000. Therefore, this is the first scenario. Right? So, what do you think? Now, I am asking what is the, how much should be the salary expense? Salary expense should be how much? Salary expense should be 50,000 or 60,000. What do you think? Can you tell me? Salary expense is not COVID. The salary expense should be my sixty thousand because right then in accounting we are not going to identify elements as an expense lama, right you can't identify these elements as a separately expense right total things total benefits related to employee should be recognized as an expense therefore am I right no need to separate then there's no my elements expense right elements is also added to the basic salary and total amount should be identified as an what salary we call that one gross salary right therefore then salary then how to record then therefore double length should be recorded for this one understand record for this one therefore right gross salary this is a double entry the salary means now my salary expense and expenses increase David salaries salary expense David 60,000 then if paid my cash deducted let's assume Current year, current month, salary will be paid in next month, right? Therefore, let's assume not yet paid, right? All things not yet paid. Therefore, not yet paid means what? Salary should be payable. Therefore, salary payable. Liability increase, liability increases steady. Salary payable credit 60,000. Understand? So, this is the first scenario, right? This is the first scenario, right? Salary pay. Therefore, don't think about basic salary and allowances. Total amount should be what? Payable to employee. Right? Huh. First of all, please write down this one. Please write down this one. <clears throat> Scenario number one. Then I'll teach you next one with the EPF adjustment. Right? EPF adjustment. Right. Okay. Write down scenario number one. Basic salary plus allowances equals gross salary. Gross salary should be the expense. Right? Right. Please write down scenario number two. Scenario number two. Right. Now, my scenario number two. 
right right now scenario number 2 right scenario number 2 now la mai in government right the government la mai there so then have you heard central central bank central bank central bank let's assume this is central bank right in central bank la mai there is a fund fund that fund la mai normally we call la mai epf fund right epf fund understood epf fund simply epf fund means simple meaning employee provident fund which is now maintaining for welfare of the welfare of the employee future purpose right future welfare of the employees therefore now right normally right then let's assume basic salary 50000 allowance is 10000 gross salary 60000 but right this government right institute central bank normally says right to the business let's assume this is the business huh? business to business don't pay total amount total payable balance to employee okkomatik employee to give one the right don't pay total amount to the employee please deduct some amount right please deducted some amount and send it to this government government fund but okkoma means 60000 pay karanna pa egen percentage ya deduct karala government e revanne gela kiyala hari e government e dawa again government says to the but business right business they are for business ekran mehima right right there is a percentages but i'll tell you the percentage value here right now total payable balance how much to employ 60000 so therefore government says okay don't pay total amount please deduct some amount percentage around 15 sorry 10 percent i'll let, end of the lesson i'll take the percentages 10 percent right please deduct 10 percent from the employee salary and that amount payable to government but please send, send it to the government right therefore how to calculate 10 percent amount right epf should be calculated on gross salary or basic salary what do you think gross salary or basic salary what is the thing it depends on the question they know how they know basic salary gross salary but mainly please tell me if you have learned this one before please tell me epf should be calculated gross salary or basic salary what for can the other on only be 10 percent actually me have it depend on the question right but always then some hard work gross salary can calculate the situation of pm sorry have i mean i mean me make them all uh See, ni ke war gross salary is after me calculate basic salary ke nuga. Har basic ke ke netam thay gross salary ke calculate. Ata question ni ke dena. Correct calculation based on gross salary or basic salary. But mummy thay na theoretical ke liye not basic salary ke calculate. Thay ma kiya dena. Me thay na theoretical. Muka thay na basic salary ke calculate. The reason actually basic salary thay ma fix amount ni fix amount. They are for always percentages. If you calculate basic salary, they are will be fix amount. Right every month. Right, fixed amount will be deducted. Right, have then or gross salary, gross salary in the calculator situation stay no way. Exam again, they know Understand, exam again, they know for in the calculator no way. Theoretical good account of the calculator, basic salary in the calculator no way. Basic salary can happen, you can calculate on gross salary. Right, a hinda, it all then can all of us say, where do you win the value in the gross salary? Where do you win on? Right, if you calculated 10% on gross salary, am I that deduction amount will be actually. Higher amount, right? Low, good up, very highest local amount. I can the blue one in the good up to basic salary in the my calcara and gross salary in calcara allowed the exam. Then I got gross salary in calcara. Then I'm with another gun basic salary, right? They are full of a basic salary. Calculate basic salary 50,000 into 10 percent. Understand how much the 10 percent then 10 percent will be 5,000. Um, 5000 they are for my remaining thing remaining amount <coughs> remaining amount we call them I after deducted employee contributions to the fund uh, employee with fund 10% that 
remaining balance namai 55000s no 55000 we call that one namai net salary net like net profit understood net salary right net salary understand very easy right okay therefore right this is the thing now namai and epf expense should be sorry uh gross salary should be the salary expense ne then if you assume salary ex salary the salary expense debit 60000 right salary payable credit salary payable credit 60000 if total amount payable to government me employee right me 60000 me employee denona no, mehem ne daanno habe government ekak kiyana government says don't pay 60000 right me ki wenne මේ payable කතාව තමයි වෙනස් කරගන්න. හරිද? ඊ salary expense එකේ ගණනව තමයි. right don't pay total 60000 right 5000 අඩු කරගෙන ඒක government එකට එවන්න කියලා තමයි කියන්නේ. understood deduct the epf 10% and please allocated as an pay, uh, payable amount to government right ඔක්කොම pay කරන්න එපා right මේ 5000 එකව වෙනම වෙන් කරගෙන තියාගන්න government ඒක කරන්නේ business එක. business එක කරන්නේ broker කෙනෙක් වගේ වැඩක් තමයි ඔතන කරන්නේ. उंट uh categorize as payable to government ena api ekata mokadda kiyanne epf payable thena adu eka water expense ekak kene business ekak neme ne yanne right that amount will be deducted from employee payable amount gewanna thiyena ekin adu karaga thena netha no 60000 thena no a meka me 5000 government this is remaining 55000 employee expense ekak araganama thama expense ekak wenas wenne right understood therefore epf contribution to uh, epf contribution by the employee should not be an expense for the business eka expense ekak kela ganne eka ara employee king adu wena nisa thamai eka expense ekak kela ganne right total ekak salary expense ganna ara payable ekak thamai maaru kara ganne hedama understood e hinda menna meka thamai salary expense gross salary ekak salary expense eda salary expense this should be epf payable right epf payable this should be salary payable net salary understood meka kara kiyana medana amaru ekkata hari anithe okkuma ne isa understand right understood the logic right deduction amount right categorized as payable to government remaining should be payable to employee so employee ta gewanna on 55 ithu pudi government ekata gewanna on kiyala wenama recognize karala right understood ha ah, please write down Okay. Therefore, this payable balance will be payable to govern, right? It will be payable in next month, following months, right? Right? Given no one, kela categorize kela, venam recognize kela, passi thamai hoga evan, hai na? Passi thamai govern mande kela evan. Me ke thamai thei na? So, ilanga dekho kora me varai theories, right? Please write down scenario number three. Right, scenario number three. Again, let's assume uh, our basic salary and allowances, same amount and gross salary. Right, our basic salary was fifty thousand. Allowances was ten thousand. And gross salary was sixty thousand, right? Now again, right? In central bank, right? In central bank, there is fund, fund, right? But now there are two funds. Now previously, in scenario number two, I told you, right? Government says, please deduct a ten percent amount and 
payable to government to that fund, EPF fund, which is deducted from what? Which is deducted from employee, employee salary, right? Employee salary in the middle of the day, power fund, they got TNO. It will be government can okay, then employee in the middle of the day, fund the developer, business taking contribution, that make them known. Okay, they scroll in trip back at the Wagon with collection and gun on, right? He scolded out of ten wagon again. He was scolding with gun at the end of the summer. Right? He's scolding and contribution at the not trip back and never a hindalamai. Government says, okay, in addition to that employee contribution, please provide some amounts to government from the business. From the business, in a business thing, look for the contribution there, may fund it available fund the gap in a EP fund me EP fund the good, right? 15% from the business, right? EPF from, from the business. Have a power up here now. There's another fund called Lamai ETF. That one also Lamai 3%, right? That one also from Lamai business, from the business. Understood from the business. Are they? It's about me ETF fund again, employ trust fund. That one also fund, right? Iggy, look who wins on it. Welfare of, of, of the employees, future purposes, right? Have I may EP fund the business second contribute to employee in the town, make their one name, right? ETF only, only love a business contributed by the business, right? No any contribution from employees. They run it. It's what may business second business will contribute currently again. Have I, right? Mehem. It's what three percent. It all that one also will be calculated on basic salary, right? If there's basic salary, you can calculate basics, right? If may especially mention uh, in questions, sometimes they will uh, mention calculate on gross salaries. Normally, and basic salary in the calculator, right? It's a good business and business. Then employee means that service providing service provider the business business set up again, employer, right? Employer, employer means the party who getting. Service from the employee, employer, the employee contribution to the employer. Understood. Therefore, right, Methanapi Balu EPF 15%. EPF 15% employee contribution, business contribution. Right. Ah, please tell me how much the value 15,000 into 15%. How much? What's the value? What's the value? 75%. 750. Yes. 750, no? 750. Correct. Correct or wrong? 750, no? Yes. 750, 750. Therefore, right? Now, Business will have to provide 750 instead of employee, right? On behalf of employee, business will provide, contribute 750 to the government, right? Central bank. They have full amount, that amount also what? Payable to government, payable to government. Have I make a one in my business again? Oh, seven, 75,000, 750, you can business able to use this. For any purpose, right? Apito make a apito photo of machine near Gandabulu, right? 7,500, yeah, 7,500, right? They can purchase a photo of machine, right? Value can it and they can win a purpose, Munahari Gandabulu. They can Api party at the business. Business in Munahari Karanabulu, the acne is only Munahari Vadagata Chikaranabulu, but Nikamburu take an employee when doing government ticket ever, right? Right? They are who. Whenever they get a power chicken on the pool, they can use business is able to use this 7,500 7, for any purposes, business activities. But they had to provide this one to the government, that fund, on behalf of employee. In Alamay, whenever they get a power chicken on the pool, Nikang fund it on an employee when you take expense that pay the income that pay. Definitely expense no. Have you any employee in a Dukaragan expense at when a day? Eka, Pinimi, Apigrania, Dukaragani, Avana, get a current. A bit expense and a business. They make right whenever they have used current pool, he not make expense at when a business ticket. EPF expense. 
understand debit 7500 understand habai lamai should be payable nemi payable to government ara employee ki 10% ne adu karagena yamana ekak payable una ekama expense ekak wenne hai meka expense ekak meka government ekak dawanna therefore what epf payable understand 7500 understood clear and also next part what's the next one 10 3 percent that one also same level right etf etf three percent from the business uh, calculate it and tell me the value from the business how much how much uh, 50 thousand and three percent how much the value 1500 and this 1500 also lamai they can use for any purposes they, they can purchase photography machine they can purchase any furnitures anything any motor vehicle land or anything but they have to provide this 1500 on behalf of the employee for employee welfare expenses expenses ETF expense, ETF, ETF expense, debit, 1500, that one also should be payable to government. Payable, ni, ekat teman no ni government. Payable, therefore what? Payable na mongad, liability interest, liability na credit. ETF, payable, right, credit, 1500. Understood. That's the thing. That's all. What shall I feel? Right. Okay. Please write down. One again, they are ready. Hurry to their own. Are Athan Sinner number two? You get ready in Bodagam Jews. Employed to give one notice only sixty thousand. Again, Benamadaga. I know forget Benamita sixty thousand. Can I forget a table legal employed? He gave five thousand. Benamad. In government business broker third party business sorry employee government five thousand government expense business understand right it all the things right Actually, now finish huh? the theoretical parts, then I'll teach you the special things how to record through ledger accounts. And there's more theoretical part to tell you total cost of salary employees. Huh? Gross salary. Gross salary. 80,000. Allowances. Uh, fifteen thousand, fifteen thousand. EPF, employer, fifteen percent. Employee, ten percent. Right, ETF three percent. It is three percent definitely by business. Ne? Calculate on on basic salary, yeah? basic salary. Right. First of all, do the working and calculate the contributions. Contribution. <coughs> calculate the contributions. Here, basic salary. E plus. Allowances equal gross salary. Gross salary, right? Basic salary eight thousand. Allowance fifteen thousand. Gross salary ninety five thousand. Ninety five thousand. Right. Then deduct the ten percent. Deduct the ten percent employee contribution. 
EPF 10% and calculate the net salary. Employee 10%, 10% lama calculate on basic salary. Yeah? Basic salary 80,000 into 10%. 8,000, 8,000, net salary should be how much? Net salary should be 80, 87,000, no? 87,000. Oh, sorry, sorry. May, this should be like, not basic gross salary. This should be basic salary. Yeah? Basic, basic. Please correct it. Basic, basic salary should be 80. Yeah? Basic salary 80,000, allowance 15,000. You have to calculate gross salary. Sorry. Correct. Right. This basic salary should be. Yeah? Therefore, calculate the EP 15% and 10%. Here on basic salary EPF fifteen percent employer business business and ETF three percent definitely business maybe business business right therefore fifteen percent uh 80 on 50, 15 on 80. How much? This is 12,000. 12,000. Right here, 80,000. Three percent. 2,400. 2,400. Right. So please put red color numbers here. From here to here, number one, this is number two, this is number three. Can you write down double entries now? There are three double entries. Huh? Can you write down double entries? I'll read this one. Can you write down double entries for salary payable with the deduction 10%? This is these two very easy, right? Definitely expense and payable. Write down the double link for this one. What's the double link? Me salary expense written on here. 95,000. Right? Salary expense. Salary expense. Salary expense. Right? Therefore, me salary expense should be how much? 95,000. Salary expense debit. Right? Salary expense debit. Ninety-five thousand. But that one also should be payable, salary payable, but salary payable credit 95, but Lama, you have to deduct it, but 8,000, that should be payable to government. You have to record what? 87. 87. Remaining should be what? Payable to government, salary payable, EPF payable. That's the first one. Right. Next one, business country will definitely expense and payable. EPF expense debit. Debit. 12,000. EPF payable credit 12,000. This one ETF also expense and payable. ETF expense debit 2,400, 2.4 kilo. EP, ETF payable. Two point four. Right. Understood. Therefore, here should be 87. No? I'll list this one and write down 87. 
8000 clear okay finish but wait huh? thanks salary salary payable and EPF payable. Ah, record the double entries in Lijay accounts. See? Salary payable credit, 87. EPF payable credit, 8. Bottom method and debit me, bottom him lila, when I'm in a full one, a catadala, name of the salary, salary and EP payable to the Homadana full one, separate Ladana full one, payable. Right? That's the first one. You write down salary. You write down salary. Right, salary. Me. Credit card number one for references. Huh? Credit, credit, debit. Uh, record these two double entries. EPF expense. And ETF expense and ETF payable. ETF payable. Right. No, no, yeah. Salary control means a salary control katawadin me me listen to me yet. Again, management accounting, they are separate account for salary control. Right? I'll tell you the meaning. Salary control means temporary account to find out salary payable amount. Then, salary pay or control There is labor costing, management accounting, labor costing. Therefore, then here only one deduction, 10%. There are so many deductions, employee loans, advances, and deductions there are control account taking where we can find out salary payable amount you know you salary control like the honey or metal salary payable right control like a method next time other way name the deduction stand look good understood i don't write salary control account here right which is related to management accounting labor cost salary control killer you take a payable killer here and the bag a temporary account right the temporary take a payable killer come at the end right Right, make it on tackle EPF expense debit 12. Right, EPF payable credit 12. So, recording same account EPF EPF payable. Right, debit credit. ETF expense debit 2.4, EPF ETF credit 2.4. Yes. Here ETF payable. Number three, debit. Here credit. Right. Right. Okay. Then here are my total payable. So there are two amounts. Total payable how much? 20,000. No? 20,000. Salary expense record on admin. Salary how much? 95,000. Right. EPF expenses 12,000. 12. EPF expense 12,000. ETF expense 2.4.
TTF expense two point five right salaries EPF ETF salary payable twenty thousand sorry salary payable salary payable how much eighty seven this one EPF payable twenty thousand. Twenty thousand uh, ETF payable two point four. Fine. Wait a minute. There are few things to explain. Two point four. Right. Now please tell me. Here salary means what's this? What should be the salary expense? Gross salary or net salary? Here salary payable means what? Gross salary or net salary? Look at. The differences. Can you tell me? And we have to identify EPF payable and ETF payable. Here, sal under salary administration expenses, salary means what? Gross salary or net salary? Here, gross salary or net salary. So, if salary expense will be my gross salary or net salary. Gross salary, you know, make 95,000 means of a gross salary. Please write down here. Gross salary. But payable means of a net salary. Right? Net salary. Understand? Net salary. Yes. But here, right? Expense will be, EPF expense will be only what? EPF 15% value. EPF 15 business contribution. Right? Business contribution should be the expense. Right? This one also ETF 3%. ETF 3% contribution. Business. Right? But Lama here. With EPF payable 20,000 means what? That 15% and 10% total amount. Right, it the company government day one no limit EPF fifteen percent and ten percent total. The method of the in your ETF three percent with right ETF three percent. Understand now nah? the claim meaning again study. Right. Understand now separate write down total employee cost. Total employee cost. Right. Anyone can tell me how much should be the total employee cost? Hurry. Salam can total employee cost. Total employee cost to kill a whole book at the key unknown. How much should be the total employee cost? How much total employee and expenses? How much the total expenses regarding employees? Business, if a culture of employees love any expenses, Kerladina. So, let me total me salary also expense EPA and EDA total of salary expense. Salary expense ninety five thousand EPF expense twelve thousand ETF expense two point four. Get the total. How much the total? How much the total? Total will be 0. 0.4 909. No, that should be the total cost. Total employee cost. Right. Total employee cost. Correct. Correct. The
correct me total this is a theory huh? now i complete all the theoretical parts now we have to do the questions yeah yeah total business cost means total employee cost to the business of the business huh? of the business of the business understand business එක කොච්චරක් employees ලා වෙනුවෙන් වියදම් කරලා දෙන expenses කොච්චරක් කරලා දෙන දින දා හැටට employee යාලට EPF EPF කියලා තියෙනවා අර 15% එක 3% දාලා දෙනවා ඒකත් expense යන්නේ business එක ඒක salary සුත් ගෙවලා දෙනවා 95 95 total should be 109.4 